Since Hurricane Matthew hit eastern North Carolina, we've had our fair share of stories involving disasters, destruction, and devastation. We've also heard stories of compassion, courage, and communities coming together as families work to recover. Today, we share how Pitt County Schools is working to make sure its students are taken care of in this week's Positively Carolina. And because I've experienced Floyd and now uh, the, the aftermath of Matthew, I know that it takes years really for people to rebuild and some people will be having to rebuild from bottom up. Cassandra Campbell is working to make sure all Pitt County students are able to return back to school after the storm. The school system is collecting supplies for kids that may have lost items due to flooding. The immediate needs are the things that any child would need to go to school and be comfortable. The idea is to get back to normal as quickly as possible. Pitt County Schools is looking for a little of everything. Underwear, socks, uniforms, shoes. We are about to uh, experience the cold weather, so soon we'll be needing coats and hats as well. The counselors are also working on addressing the students and families' personal state. Campbell says many of the people currently experiencing loss as adults experienced a similar situation during Hurricane Floyd as children. When working with people that have been experienced hardships like these, we have to take into account what they have been through. Campbell is also asking anyone who has not been in touch with their school to call immediately so they can help if possible. Please call your school because we want to know where you are so we can assist you. Pitt County Schools is collecting donations and money to buy supplies as needed because there's little storage space at their facility. The schools north of the Tar River are holding an event on Saturday to collect items. We have the information on that event on our website if you'd like to donate there.